Hey there, everyone. I know it's been a long time since I've put a video out, and uh, with all that has been going on, it's just really been, this has been like something I've never even remember experiencing in my whole lifetime, the things that we have been through in the last uh, three months even, to even believe all so much has happened in three months' time. And, uh, you know, uh, when this whole thing began with COVID, I sat down and I asked God, I was like, what is going on? Something's going on. And so um, if, if uh, any, of the, any of you who know me or have come to my retreats, you know, uh, what I've told you before is that when, when, when God is speaking to me, I just kind of go into quiet mode to understand and learn what the Lord is teaching me. And then once I feel like I've had enough, that, that I've learned enough and I understand enough, then I come out and share. The Lord has asked me to share what, what he shares with me. He's asked me to share with others. So that's kind of why I've been quiet because it's been a lot <laughs> to take in over these last two or three months. But, uh, you know, where, where this whole thing comes to is, you know, we look at this whole world. We look at all that's going on right now. And so much seems to be out of control. So much seems to be, there seems to be just like almost just this evil that's just rampant. That there's so much division and so much anger and strife and and so many people fighting for control over this and that and after kind of just going through this whole loop of you know just seeing what the Lord is showing me it's taken me right back to where he had me before of remembering that this is about the kingdom of God because right now there are so many different forces and so many different people and, and groups that want to have control, that want to take control, want to change things. But what God is saying is that it's the kingdom of God that rules. And so it is time for us as his people to stand up and let his kingdom be seen, let his kingdom be known. And so, uh, because, you know, we are here as believers, we are here to, um, to rule this earth. We're here to rule the world. And uh, we've been too quiet and we've been too timid and we've been too afraid. And so um, I just want to really, I, I, I believe what the Lord is telling me and, and showing me is that it is time for us to build up our army, the army of the kingdom of God. We really need to focus on and listen to the Holy Spirit and learn how to be the, the, the citizens and the rulers actually of the kingdom of God. He's given us rulership. And so um, there's so much to cover. There's so much to talk about. And what I'm thinking that I want to do is to start a Zoom group. And just maybe uh, once every two weeks, uh, not have it be to last too long, maybe 30 or 40 minutes a time, have a short little study and a, and a discussion. Because we've got to start breaking free ourselves first. Here's what the Lord wants to do. He wants to be in the midst of all this turmoil because we know that things are going to get worse in this world. But as things get worse, his people are supposed to rise up and be the light and be able to point people to him. That means we've got to be together. We've got to be together in unity. We've got to be together as far as uh, having peace of mind and, and uh, being calm in the midst of all of the, whatever is going on. It's about being joyful. It's about showing the world what the kingdom of God looks like. And so in order to do that, we've got to be healthy ourselves. So I would like to talk about that and, 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 and just really you know discuss this and learn and ask the Holy Spirit to show us how to manifest the kingdom of God. He said, "My kingdom, thy kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. If there was ever a time that we need the kingdom here on this earth, it is right now. And so it's time for us to wake up. It's time for us to understand who we are and whatever shackles are holding us down and keeping us from, from feeling free in, in Jesus and being all that we're supposed to be, it is time for for him to break all of that, to allow him to break all of that off of us so that we can be the people that he says that, that, that we are so that the world can see his kingdom because the, his kingdom is the only thing that's going to change this place. No politician is going to change it. No group is going to change it. Only the kingdom of God is going to change it. So I'm going to be posting out here pretty soon uh, when we're going to start meeting. If you would like to be involved in it, I hope that you will because this is going to be like awesome. <laughs> it's going to be so freeing for us because in order, before we can help the world, we've got to be where God wants us to be. And he wants us to be ruling and reigning in our lives. Soundness of mind, joy, peace, having provision. I mean, so that people can look at us and say, wow, what is it about you guys that makes you so different? That is how we draw people into the kingdom of God. So the Lord is saying it's time for us 
to be fed. It's time for him to feed us, uh, to let him feed us and build us up so that we can be everything that he says we're supposed to be. So if you want to be a part of this, of these discussions, I hope that you will stay posted because it is time. That's all I can say. It is super time. Uh, anyway, I hope everybody's doing well. I miss all of you and uh, we are going to be talking soon. So stay posted. God bless you. Bye-bye.